We've discussed ANOVA single factor, but what if you have two factors and you're trying to figure out um, how they interact? Well, in the QI macros in Excel, you can figure those kinds of things out. And so here we have two different, three different kinds of material, and then we have different uh, temperatures we're processing that at, and we have four reputation, uh, replications of each one of those things. So we want to do an ANOVA two factor. So one factor is the material, the other factor is the temperature. And we have four repetitions. So if you just select that data with your mouse, click on the QI macros, go over to QI macros tools, you can do a two factor with replication or one without replication. So if you had varying numbers but you didn't have any replication, you could use that. But we are going to pick two factor with replication. It'll ask us for how many rows along the left-hand side are our repetitions, that's four, and the level of significance, 0.05, and I'm going to squeeze this down a little bit. Well, maybe not. There we go. Let's make that a little smaller. Excel is always so picky. And so here we have our ANOVA, so here's our 15, 70, and 125 temperature, and our various uh, types of material. We're going to squeeze that down a little bit. <clears throat> and here you can see our p-values, but essentially those are all less than our 0.05 alpha value. And that says we should reject the null hypothesis that these have the same uh, means, uh, because the p-value is less than 0.05. So different materials and different uh, temperatures give us a different uh, analysis. And so what we'd want to do here is go figure out what's the one that's going to give us the optimal uh, that we're shooting for. Now I don't have the specs on this so we don't actually know what to choose, but it's pretty simple to go in and do this analysis and figure out, you know, they are different and so how do we want to go about deciding how to work on this. And the QI macros can be downloaded to 30-day trial from qimacros.com.